and something that I am so excited about, Real Presence Cloud Access Suite. Now, if you look on the right-hand side, you'll see Skype or Google Talk, Facebook, LinkedIn, and others, anything that has a presence engine. On the left-hand side of the globe, you'll see enterprises that, frankly, could never talk to each other. We took the first and most important step a year and a half ago by incorporating the TIP protocol into our product so we could be the first leader in terms of interoperability so Polycom could talk to a Cisco. We've now taken that to the next step. We're going to connect the consumer world into the business world. But we're going to do it very differently than any other company out there. We're going to do it that's secure, it's resilient, it's easy to use, it's accessible. And Ron will provide all the details around that. So again, everything now comes together into the Polycom Real Presence Cloud Access Suite. And we believe this is the breakthrough, finally, to move to B2B and to B2C. And I'd like to have Jim Kruger, our Senior Vice President of Product Marketing, come up for a quick demonstration. Jim? We have come a long way, and I am very excited to be able to demo to you, for the first time in public, the Real Presence Cloud Access Suite. So Andy talked about the, the video islands, uh, as well as simplicity of use. We are solving that in a big way today. We're, I'm going to show you a demo here, so we're going to jump right into it. On the, right -hand, on the left hand side here, you actually see the application. And on the very far left, you see uh, a directory of contacts. You see Skype, you see Google Talk, you can actually add Facebook into that. You can add Microsoft Link, IBM Same Time, as well as your corporate directory for all the Polycom conference rooms. So what we've done here is we've created a, a, com a combined, aggregated, presence-based directory that's personalized for you. So when you want to make a call, you basically look at that directory. You can see who's present and who's available to call. So we're going to start up a live call here. Uh, we're going to take someone from my Skype address book, drag them in. We're going to take someone from Google Talk, we're going to drag them in, and we're going to take someone from a Polycom conference, phone, a conference room and actually drag them in as well. So you see them at the top, and so I'm all uh, queued up and ready to start my call. You see the simplicity of use, basically drag and drop. We're going to click Start Call. So as soon as we click on Start Call, it's actually going to do something in the background here where it's going to basically send an instant message automatically to the users of the Skype and the Google Talk um, uh, uh, contacts that I sent over. So you see recent, uh, that's blinking in orange there. There's an IM that I've sent to this individual. And it basically says, join my Polycom conference. And you see that there's a link there. So all that user has to do is click on that link, and it enables their browser. So any standards-based browser, whether it's Internet Explorer, Firefox, they click on that and it initiates the call. They don't need anything, just their PC and a webcam to join into this call. So you see it's connecting. And uh, this will be the, the guest site. This is the host site over here. So you see uh, Sam here in the front row, who's actually connecting the call. And you'll see the other parties come on uh, in just a second. So, so as soon as uh, they come up, which you see them here in the window, Sam, we can actually change the order there. So when you maximize, you can actually see the different callers there. Uh, you can also share content and do true collaboration as a part of this application. Uh, you can also uh, do group chat as a part of this. You also see that there's uh, the quality on each side of this. You see the conference room, Skype, as well as Google. So you see um, the quality on each side is, actually, is, is exactly the same. So when that Skype user clicked on that link, initiated their browser, uh, they're actually coming in on Polycom technology, enterprise class secure Polycom technology. So everybody on the call has the exact same experience. So you see the quality here on the host side, you see the quality here on the guest side of, of the experience. So simplicity of use, high quality experience, never been done before. Combining Google, Skype, a Polycom conference room, amazing quality. So uh, the, other, the other component of this is if you look at the, the host side here where they act, this technology has been deployed, either in their network or in a service provider network, it's going to be IT approved because it's secure. So when this participant over here or the Google participant, or the other Polycom conference uh, room, or any standards-based conference room joins that call, it's coming in over a secure link. So this is the way that we're solving the problem of bringing video islands together. You saw the simplicity of drag and drop. You also saw the simplicity of the participant clicking 
enabling their browser, coming into the call, high quality, best experience. This is the way that we're solving the problem that Andy talked about in terms of the impediments around uh, security, around ease of use, and around the simplicity of bringing these video islands together for B2B and B2C. You can see Facebook, Google Talk, Skype, it's simply bringing the contacts into the directory. Very simple. Second is you have your global directory here. You drop and drag and you select the participants. So just what Jim did. The three participants into the call. You then simply click Start Call. So host starts the call. The invitee will receive a link in the chat window and will simply launch the browser. Click and start the browser, whether it's Firefox, whether it's Microsoft Explorer, Mozilla, or Chrome, or any, any traditional standard browser. So now you have, whether it's a Polycom, whether it's a Google Talk, Facebook, Skype, any presence pitch engine, and a multi-point call. Here's the host view. Here's the participant view. All high quality. You can also share content. Whiteboard, and as Rama will talk about, many other collaboration attributes and technologies. And then the call is securely terminated by hitting end call. It is very, very simple to use and very groundbreaking and very different from any other technology available in the market. And Rama will share with you why this is so important to CIOs. So again, we can extend our enterprise-grade video collaboration from rooms, theaters, desktops, tablets, smartphones, to millions. We believe it's actually billions of users on any presence-based video app, any browser, any device. It runs on Real Presence Platform, the most interoperable, scalable, secure UC platform for high-quality B2C and B2B collaboration. Very important. Universal browser access. There is no download required. The other technologies in the marketplace require an app download. No download required for end users to join and no costly add-ons as the other competitors do in terms of gateways or hardware or lack the native integration for the host. This global presence directory brings all the presence applications and directory into one address list. Skype, Google Talk, Facebook, Link, same time, and other presence applications. And finally, as I said before, it's a software application for the Real Presence platform. Allows it to run in the data center, empowers the public cloud, service provider solutions, our partners delivering video collaboration as a service. 